Hey everybody, wanted to show you this really great kayak um, that we just got. Just put it on the water for the first time, super comfortable, very stable, and it is a two-person kayak. So my wife sits in the front, I sit back here, plenty of room. I'm 6'2", and I have lots of room in here even when she's sitting in front of me. Very stable, very comfortable. Let's take a closer look at assembly now. Okay, so let's get this all unboxed and inflated. All right, so now we're just taking everything out of the box. You've got your seats, you've got your inner portion that you'll inflate, you have your kayak, you've got your pump and your oar, your emergency repair kit, and your bag and your rudder. So now we're just undoing the strap that's around the kayak so that we can lay it out flat. Now you'll want to put your pump together. This part's really simple, pretty much self-explanatory. Now you'll locate one of the air nozzles on one of the sides of the kayak, attach your hose, and then by stepping on the base of the pump, you're able to very easily inflate it. It inflates one side at a time, very easy to do. All right, so then when you're done with that side, you'll want to attach the cap and then it's on to the other side to do the exact same thing. All right, so now you're gonna to wanna to take the inner portion and you're gonna uh, stretch it out so that it goes down the entire length of the kayak. All right, now you'll locate that nozzle, undo that one, and you're gonna pump up this middle section here. That cover back on. All right, there she is. She is a beauty. All right, now we need to get our seats installed. This is a two person kayak. It is uh, got a weight capacity of a thousand pounds, so perfect for two people. So you'll just attach the hooks of the seat to the D-rings on both sides of the kayak. And you'll do this for the front and the back the exact same way. Notice there on the back of the seat, you do have a little zippered pocket. So a little bit of extra storage in your seats. Then you'll want to just adjust them so that they don't go all the way back and you can sit comfortably. All right, and 
Here's the back of the seat. It's very cushiony and the seat part is very cushiony and here is that pocket, that little um, compartment I was telling you about. All right, now y'all need to attach the rudder and then pin it in. And remove these protections from the two other rudders. And then, simple to do, just uh, put together your oar. It's a double-sided oar. All right, we got everything assembled, ready for the water test. Let's jump in and take a ride. Do you like that it does have this little um, transport strap so that you can easily get it down to the bank to launch? All right, looks pretty seaworthy to me. Here is my husband in the kayak. He's about 190 pounds. You can see that it's sitting really nicely on top of the water. Very stable. The oars are great as well. He's coming to come pick me up. Here we go. So I am about 160 pounds. So the two of us fit very comfortably in this kayak and we're having a lot of fun cruising around the lake. And he's shaking it just to give it a little stability test and super stable, you guys. All right, just wanna show you how I'm getting out of the kayak. Like I said, it's really stable and I didn't have any trouble at all. Great kayak, that was a fun little ride. So now let's take it out, get it deflated and packed up in the carry bag. So you basically just undo everything that you did to inflate it. You're gonna to wanna to remove the rudder. You're gonna to wanna to unattach your seats on all of the D-rings. All right, now you're going to deflate all the pieces starting with the middle one first. Just press that little button there. It's gonna start to deflate. And when it's deflated a little bit, you can take it out and then you're basically going to just squeeze the air out. Now you'll release the air from both sides of the kayak. Starts to deflate immediately. And then you're just gonna squeeze the air out of it. We like to do this just by folding it and kneeling on it. All right, it packs up really, really compact and then attach your strap. And then everything goes in the bag. And it does come with a nice um, watertight repair kit that you can carry with you all the time in case you have an emergency out on the water. Super easy disassembly deflation and the bag has plenty of room. You know, a lot of times you get tents and things that barely fit in the bag. This bag is very, very roomy. So if you're looking for a new kayak for the spring and summer, two person, inflatable, easily to port around, easy to inflate, highly recommend this one. Thanks for watching.